Welcome back to the Solutions Manual. In this video, we will solve the problem F5-2 from R.C. Hibaler Engineering and Statics 14th edition. According to this problem, we have to determine the horizontal and vertical components of reaction at the pin A and the reaction on the beam at C. So to solve this problem, first of all, we have to draw all the forces and the support reactions on this beam. So point A is pin connected. So we have a vertical support reaction and the horizontal support reaction. We have a force due to this member CD at point C. So I am assuming it as a compressive force. Let's label them. So this right here is AY. This is AX. And let's call this F. CD. Now we have to resolve this force FCD into its components. So we have a horizontal component and the vertical component. Let's call this angle theta. So the vertical component is FCD sine theta and the horizontal component is FCD cos theta. So now we have to find this angle theta. So for theta, we can consider the triangle ADC. This triangle. And if I draw it separately, then it would look something like this. This is A. This is D and that C. This angle right here is theta. This side is 1.5 meters. And the height is also 1.5 meters. So for the angle theta, we can do tan theta is equals to opposite, which is 1.5 over the adjacent which is also 1.5 so theta comes out to be 45 degrees so now we can apply our equations of equilibrium so my first equation is summation of moments at point a equals to 0 i am considering counterclockwise direction as positive since the line of action of ay and ax is passing through the point a so these two forces do not have any moment arm with respect to the point A. So AY and AX will not produce any moment about the point A. The vertical component of FCD force, which is FCD sin theta, is trying to rotate the beam in counterclockwise direction about the point A. So the moment produced by this FCD sin theta will be taken as positive. And theta is 45 degrees. And the moment arm is this 1.5 meter distance. Since the line of action of the horizontal component of FCD force, which is FCD cos theta, is passing through the point A, so FCD cos theta does not have any moment arm with respect to the point A. So FCD cos theta will not produce any moment about the point A. This 4 kN force is trying to rotate the beam in clockwise direction about the point A. So the moment produced by this 4 kN force will be taken as negative. So negative 4 and the moment arm is this 1.5 plus 1.5 meters. So 3 meters equals to 0. So upon simplification FCD comes out to be 11.31 kN. So this is our first answer. Now we have to do the working for the support reaction AX. We can do summation of forces in X direction equals to 0. I am considering right hand side as positive. 
so we have fcd cos theta and theta is 45 degrees minus ax equals to 0 ax is equals to fcd cos 45 and fcd is 11.31 kN so 11.31 into cos 45 So the support reaction AX comes out to be 8 kN So this is our second answer And now for the support reaction AY We can do summation of forces in y direction equals to 0. I am considering up direction as positive. So we have Ay plus Fcd sin theta and Fcd is 11.31. So 11.31 sin 45 degrees minus 4 kN equals to 0 so ay comes out to be negative 4 kN and you can see that we are getting the negative answer the negative answer means that the direction we had assumed earlier for ay force is incorrect earlier we had assumed the support reaction ay in the upward direction but in fact, it is acting in the downward direction. So this is it for this problem. I hope you would find this video helpful. If you do, please make sure to subscribe to this channel and also turn on the bell icon for the daily updates. And if you have any questions or any doubts in the free body diagram or in the equations of equilibrium, then feel free to ask in the comment section and I will try to answer them as soon as possible. Thank you.